Hello. Hey. This is Ash. She's my friend. So I thought, since I have the opportunity, I'm going to do the best friends tag with you. Wow. Are you ready? Yes. Apparently these questions are pretty, pretty intense. So what you're telling me is you've done this tag so you can get rid of me. I don't want to get rid of you. <laughs> can I, I just point out, I'm not getting rid of her purely for the t-shirt she's wearing. <gasps> but they can't see it. What it's am I going to do? It's right because it's mentioned in a question. Oh, so you have to okay. watch the rest of the I video. I see what she's done there. It's a secret. There's 22 questions. I will copy them into the description below if you also want to do the tag with your friends. I will also link to Ash's channel because she's awesome. The dreaming tribute. Hashtag just saying. We've all got to wear and stuff, so yeah. Get on it, guys. Okay, question one. How did you meet and when? <gasps> I actually know the answer to this question. Oh, yay! Because I've forgotten. It's a good start. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> we met at uni. We go to uni together. Yeah, it was the first day. Yeah. We were at uni and it was Freshers Week and it was a meet up in the Weatherspoons. Mm. And in Folkestone. In Folkestone. We lived in Folkestone at the time. And I remember being really nervous and I walked in and you were sat with one of our other friends, Shelby. Who I live with. You know Shelby. Yeah. The one who's graduating. And and we ended up drinking and getting to know each other and, and we've been best friends ever since. Alright, question two is, what is your favourite memory together? Oh. Um, I used to go to Ashley's a lot after work, and one day we were just sat there, probably until about 2, 3am. He explained where Hawaii was to me. <laughs> <laughs> I now know where this story is going. <laughs> I got confused and wasn't quite sure where it was. So she had this big blank wall, kind of like this one. And she genuinely, like, imaginary drew a map for me on this wall and was going like, yeah. right, this bit's America, this bit's Canada, this bit's yeah. Europe, this is where we are, and I was just like, so where's Hawaii? I remember, I remember that. That yeah. was so funny. Is and there... you, you thought Wales and Scotland was the other way around. I got, I was tired, it was like 1am. I think... Was it that one? There's so many. No, that's what, that one's really good. That, I think that's like the funniest one of Yeah, that's the funniest one. It's mostly at um, my expense. I think probably my favourite memory was your birthday last year oh. when it was Doctor Who themed and I surprised Mel by dressing up as the TARDIS. I, I had like police box across my jacket and stuff like that. Oh no. Describe each other in one word. Ooh. I think Ashley is caring. Oh, that's cute. And evil. Mel is dependable. Interesting. Because whenever, whether it's university or whether I need to speak to someone, she's on the end of the phone or she's there and she literally like walks around my house like yeah. early hours of the morning. Hey, question four. That's four. Four. four yeah. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Oh, I can't count. <laughs> is what's your dream job? So we both have to answer this one. Well, my dream job, I know what my dream job is. My dream job is to open a performing arts school yeah. for children and adults with disabilities so they can have therapy through performing arts, music and art in general. That's really my dream job is basically to be a full-time author and novelist and just journalist in general and work from home. So I have like a beautiful office with inspirational posters and books everywhere and like my own personal library I have this and then write all the time. I have this feeling the only time I'm ever going to see you is on Skype when you get this dream job. Let's Question sure. five. Oh god. I already know the answer to yours, that's fine. Oh do you? Yeah. Oh my gosh. What is, I can't pronounce it though. What is your favourite makeup brand? Ah, uh, okay. You can't pronounce it though. No. Okay. <laughs> um, mine is, well it's Slash too. <gasps> it's Slash. I have Tony Moly, which is a Korean brand. Yeah. Um, which I love because it's all organic because I have very sensitive skin. Mm. So it's all organic and I am moisturised from there as well. But then I Urban, which are was bought for my twentieth by Michelle Hicken and she it was like a palette and their eyeshadows and powders and all that kind of stuff. They do like limited edition, they did one for Alice in Wonderland when you open the top and cool. it was like a three D kind of thing. Oh, it's amazing. Amazing. And they're just so... I'm wearing it now. I'm wearing the brown now. That's She's a walking effort. Yes. 
the cheapest one. <laughs> uh, I quite like. What do I like? Well, you have Maybelline. I've got a lot of Maybelline stuff. She has a lot of Maybelline, which I think is really good. Like, if if I haven't had a chance to order my... Like, because I order mine off the internet, because yeah. flying to Korea to get it would be crazy. But... Maybelline's quite good. I like but Maybelline. But I, I think my favourite brand is actually technically not a brand. Go on, then. It's Too True by Superdrug. So it was yeah. a branch it's of a brand. It's like a branch of Superdrug yeah. is Too True. But it's really good, because quite a lot of their makeup's like two for five pound or three for five pound and stuff. Mm. Just because I'm cheap. Mm. Six. six. Oh my god. Six. 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 What if it was a real normal thumb? You do. You do number. Six. Okay. We your weird thumbs. Yeah. Um. What is something that annoys you about the other person? Um. So sorry. what? So what? Um. Annoys you about me? I then? think sometimes you struggle. Well, not struggle. I need to find my word. I struggle. You struggle. You just struggle. <laughs> you, just struggle. you are a struggle. No, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> I think sometimes you struggle with your own outward identity. If does that make sense? A little bit, but I, I want you to clarify. <laughs> so, so when we'll be getting ready for a night out, Mel will turn around to me and go, "Oh, I like this, but would you wear it?" Yeah. Where it wouldn't matter if I would wear it because she's going to wear it. <laughs> Which is, that's the only thing, I think, is when okay. you look for clarification for, for if we like it. And I'm like, yeah. but we're not the ones wearing it. See, there's nothing really that anno like that you oh. annoy me with. Um, oh, it's not even about you, really. Well, that The one thing that annoys me about Ashley is where she lives. <laughs> Basically, I live half an hour away from everything, <laughs> so I have to walk to theirs. No. And, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have to walk to theirs like in the middle of the day, and then end up walking home at one a.m. in the dark. We up a really long road. I literally live in the road next to the university, and it's that like a five-minute walk from town. That bugs me. But the fact that she chose to live this far away, I didn't. It's not my fault. I'm sorry. <laughs> Basically, what annoys you about me annoys me about me. <laughs> what annoys you about me is that you is you. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. Um, I think I've given up with the point system. <laughs> um, question seven is... I think I know the answer to this. Okay. If you could go anywhere in the world together, where would you go and why? <gasps> I think there's a couple of answers. I think, my an I think the answers that you're going to say yeah. are Korea, yeah. America... Yeah. And Disneyland Paris together. Yes. Well, actually, I think probably Disney America. Yeah. Rather than Disneyland Paris. Um, favorite inside joke? Question eight. Oh my gosh, there's so many. It's either there's so many or there's none. <laughs> but there is so many. But they're like so inside jokes that you forget it's an inside joke until you actually say it. Yeah, and then everyone looks at you going, uh, what? What is there? Oh, there's loads. We do have an inside joke with Alex, and it's my fault, um, Optical Illusion. Optical yeah. Illusion. Which... Even I don't understand that inside well, joke. The inside joke is that I had a dream that I went downstairs because the fire, the fire alarm was going off mm. and Alex was in the kitchen with a frying pan with a hole in the bottom going, Optical I can see Illusion. <laughs> and it's stuck, so we all say it. Cool. All right. Um... Question nine: Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? You, definitely. I can get ready I'm not. It's, it's me. You know when Mister and Missus where they have that paddle and they both go up at the same time. Yeah, pink me. Well, no, I'm blue. More likely, you're pink. I'm blue. not pink. Can what? I be purple? Yeah, um, yeah. that's fair. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's next? Do you want to say one? No. Right. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favourite season now? What, right, what do you think my favourite season is? Well, it wouldn't be winter because you always moan. You always I'm moan. always cold. And it wouldn't be summer because she always moans. I moan not. <laughs> summer and winter, she she just moans, moans. I think it would... <sighs> this is technically a trick question. Why? Say what you think it is. Like, genuinely. I want to say spring because of all the new stuff and the 
Yeah. Ah, but autumn, I would think, would be better writing weather for you because of all the stuff that's You're around. fucking spot on. Ah. It's actually a mix between spring I and autumn. See. see, but because, you know mine. Yeah. You know mine flat out, right? It's winter. Yes. Winter is coming. Literally, because... What because, that t-shirt reference? Yeah. There you go. There's <laughs> the t-shirt reference. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm currently wearing a Game of Thrones t-shirt there you go Pro six pound buy it yes oh my god i walked in and was like oh my god seriously she nearly died but yeah winter i'm literally i'm a jumper person i like i like winter as long as i can get warm i have got amazing fashion sense in winter when summer oh, comes around so good when summer comes around i look at my wardrobe and i, I literally i think the only summer thing i own is these leggings and that's just because they've got netting on the knees not fabric what is your favourite song? Oh, yours is gonna be like a K-pop one. No, it's not no. actually. No. Oh, no, I don't know. I don't know her favourite song. Oh, that's good because I don't think I know yours either. I haven't got one. <laughs> well, because you listen to so many different types of music. Yeah. I go from like country to metal to classic yeah. to proper like Britney Spears pop. Yeah. My favourite song is I think it might be quite surprising actually hmm. is "Fast Car" by Tracy Chapman. I like that song. Um, you ready for this question? Go on. What is it like being best friends with somebody who's obsessed with YouTube? I think it's easier because yeah. we're both obsessed. I think we both like the same YouTubers. Yeah, we're like um like Superwoman, and mm. Dan is not on fire and yeah. Amazing Phil and Jack's Gap. Yeah, you quite like Zoella. I love I've Tyler. not watched that earlier. I like Tyler Oakley and Marcus Butler. He's yeah, he's good. So I, but I started with his really early videos, so yeah. I don't quite like them. But his new stuff looks. Do really you cool. not? No. Mm -hmm. But I seem to skip everyone's early videos. Mm. <coughs> I'm dying. Um, Please don't do that. I'm gonna try. But Death. I really like Hell You Back, which probably a lot of you won't have heard of. Which is she reviews K dramas. Oh. But she's an American and she moved to South Korea with her and she's out there with her husband who's mm. also American and she's just so funny. I think it's cool being friends with somebody that likes YouTube, like you said, because we both like it so much. Yeah. Um, and I think it makes us not afraid when someone else gets a camera, we're just like, oh, it's a camera. Yeah. Okay, so we finished our best friend tag. We did. And we're still best friends. Yes. High five. Love how we did that without looking. <laughs> I looked. Oh, no, you have Do it right, do it. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly hit me in the face. <laughs> oh dear. But we're still best friends. We're still best friends. Have you got a message for my viewers? <gasps> like what? Ah! Oh, okay. She's gone. Time is precious. Waste it wisely. Subscribe to her face. Here. You can subscribe to my face. Here. On the back.